just finished up at the dealership here, Smoky Mountain, Harley Davidson. Um, ran into Rusty Baker, 24, here. He gave me a tour around the dealership. And then I also ran into Timmy, who works here as well, which is <laughs> like, it's awesome. Um, I feel like I'm already like part of the family. <laughs> I'm going to get back out on the road. I have to get to Pigeon Forge before they close at four o'clock today. So I'm gonna find Wall in Tennessee. That's gonna take me there. I'm um, going to do some of the new Foothills Parkway routes. Stop at the gas station that's literally at the end of it and get some catfish. <laughs> Fresh catfish. It stinks that I have to like always be on a schedule, but still, still worth it for sure to do that. So let's see what route I am taking. I think I'm going back in the direction I was supposed to, right? Yeah, that would make sense. Okay. Alrighty, here we go. Oh, it's so far away. I'm probably in too low of a gear or too high of a gear. Oh yeah. All right, let's try one. Okay. So, oops, I'm in neutral. I am going to be riding the new part of the Foothills Parkway. Sorry, good. Is she knows. The new portion of it. So Pigeon Forge is 25 miles away. That's not bad at all. But this route will take me directly back to Eagle Rider and I heard it was probably a good one to um, finish out on. So, we are going to ride it, see how I like it. No fuel or food available on Parkway. <laughs> good to know. Good thing I ate at the shed at the Smoky Mountain, Harley Davidson. This would be a crazy ride to bike. Like, I give that guy props. I don't know if you can see him. Like, that's a lot, a lot of work. I would rather take the actual motorcycle. <laughs> Good work, guys. Oh, that looks like rain. Please don't let it be rain. That's like the story of my life this weekend. Gorgeous weather. Freaking rain crowds. Just drop out of nowhere. So I was taking some pictures. <laughs> and now all of this is coming this way. <sighs> Shoot. <laughs> not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. Not good at all. I'm probably going to get dumped on. Again, but that is my life so far. Go figure. But I'm going to try to beat some of this if I can. If I can't, well, just call it an extra shower for today. Thank you, Foothills Parkway. <laughs> okay, dookie, let's go. Okay. <laughs> it would be the hardest time trying to reach that thing kickstand. Turn, turn, turn. I'm getting better at these turns, kind of. Not really. Ugh, ah, so much muscle. Okay. <laughs> so many sport bikes. Definitely wants me, like makes me want to ride one out here. Just for the sake of like, the difference. Oh God, it's wet. Mm. Just like the difference of feeling with riding the sport bike versus a cruiser style. Like how different can it be? Is it really that much of a preference? I'm like, my curiosity is sparked. Guys, I'm kind of glad I turned off my GoPro. It was like whiteout conditions, water running all the way across the road. I didn't get to enjoy the foothills. <laughs> 
At least like the section, the section after I left the photo shoot spot area. I was doing 20 miles an hour just so I could like keep going. There was no spots to pull over. Oh, I gotta put this wet, wet jacket back on. <laughs> oh, it's the worst having to put wet clothes back on. Oh, I've never ridden in that hard of a rainstorm before. And to do it on a freaking windy parkway. <laughs> Guys, it was supposed to be like a, a last little hurrah fun moment and it was not so I finished it it was still downpouring rain thankfully there was a couple here with an ultra had it parked they kind of moved the bike over a little bit so I could squeeze my bike and myself in there for that little bit and take shelter so I got my catfish sandwich like I wanted to but now I need to get back out on the freaking road and ready set go oh my god I can't I'm stuck <laughs> like my legs are stuck to my jeans I couldn't lift my jeans couldn't lift my legs up <laughs> God dang it all. <laughs> I got rained on way too much this weekend. Way too much. But I had an absolute blast still, regardless of it all. Made the best of it. And I want to thank you again to Harley Davidson Eagle Rider for allowing this to happen for the weekend. I'm beyond impressed with myself with how much I have pushed my riding limits and riding capabilities and just like mentally challenging myself throughout these last, I don't want to say 24 hours, but yeah, it's been more than 24 hours, 48 hours. <clears throat> yeah, I think that's all I got for today. So thank you so much for tuning in. Always ride safe and we will see you guys in the next vlog. Bye.